If we did heroic Ills Hillsbrad foothills, except summon. Oh, whoops. Incest simulator music. Is this Crusader Kings? Crusader Kings 3 official soundtrack. Wait, isn't this guy a vendor? Oh, whoops. I, I didn't mean to attack him. Don Carlos. Wait, doesn't this guy drop a hat? There's a quest to get his hat? I have his hat in retail. Wait, wait. Share quest. Oh, you can't? I was not ready at all for this. I, I, I attacked him because I thought he was a vendor. <laughs> I thought it was a vendor. I did. I couldn't remember how you get his hat. I thought, I thought you buy it from him. Uh, Heroic drops a blue hat without the quest. Oh, really? I need the I need the non-quest hat. I need it. I, it's my bis. That's my bis, bro. Wait, he didn't drop anything. This boss sucks. Okay, let's see here. We are gonna go buff. Ugh. I don't have symbols. Do you have extra symbols? I forgot to restock. Thank you. Okay, here we go, chap. Go. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I thought it was in Discord the whole time, and I just realized it wasn't. Yeah, I mean, uh, I, I think I think this shouldn't be too bad. Uh, okay. It's fine. I can just kite him here. Like this, look. Just give him this one, dude. <laughs> oh, he can't get him split up. This is like, I, I remember doing this one where I was leveling in Elwyn Forest. I would jump over the, I would jump over the fences to kite mobs. This is why leveling is important. Yeah, exactly. Any stat booster? Yeah, right here. Oh, oh my gosh. Frick. It's fuel time. Oh, 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 wait, what? Uh, oh. hey, can we, uh, can we do this? Go okay, we got Earthmind? Okay, yeah, 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 good call. Here's the game plan. We do this. Keep them all on me. It's super important. I have aggro the whole time. You put an Earthmind here. I feel like we're right cheating here. right now. We're gaming. Yeah, we're just gaming. Okay, yeah, I have no idea how we pulled that off. <laughs> that was so cheesy. That was so cheesy. Very well then. Chat, we gotta enjoy the RP here. Wait, doesn't he actually say something? I thought there was voice lines here. Nope. <laughs> there's not. You have forced my hand. Oh, there's the voice lines. We're all using OP horde racials. Dude, chat, did you see how long it took Thrall to join our group? It's because he was stuck in queue, man. He had to wait like 30 minutes until he got to come play. That's what happens when you're Horde. <laughs> Thrall faction change. I did not ask for this. Dude, <laughs> I did not ask for this while well, Thrall's beating their ass. When I, it's like my dad when I was little, dude. My dad would spank me and he would say, this hurts me more than it hurts you. <laughs> Some of the stupid stuff I did when I was a kid, I would have beat my own ass, I'll be honest. Uh, S fan would enjoy that over the knee experience. That's come on, really? Oh yeah, consecration. Yeah, this guy's paladin. Draw. Yeah, so you didn't really harsh. think you I would said. escape, did you? You and your allies shall answer to Blackmore. After I've had my fun. Wait, his consecration is for seven hundred. I wish my consecration was that good. I can't tell which one's which. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna trade consecrates with him. Oh, what an idiot, dude. He could have killed me and I was healing himself. Frick, you guys can kick that. Guards! Nice. Guards! Nice! That was badass. Pontus Pantaloons of Prophecy. What does it look like? Yeah, why do these look like... These These look like some yoga pants that you would buy at the BlizzCon store. Here, D'Antonio, put these on. Very well. These look like something somebody would buy at BlizzCon. Let's ride. Oh, yeah, look, chat, it's young Blanche. What is it you wish? Instead of old Blanche, it's young Blanche from uh, from Westfall. So what this dungeon is in the Caverns of Time, we've gone back in time to old Hillsbrad. That's why we're like here saving Thrall or whatever. We're going back in time to stop these people who are trying to like change the course of history. We go to old Hillsbrad to save Thrall here. The Black Morass, what Black Morass is, I believe, they're trying to stop Medivh opening the Dark Portal. But if they never opened the Dark Portal, the the orcs would have never come to Azeroth. So the, the RP of it is basically like you're going back to allow Medivh to open the portal. You have to do it just to make sure that like the fabric of time doesn't like collapse or something. Yeah, I need to I need to put on more defensive gear for this, you're right. I did not ask for this. I did not ask for this. Yeah, I guess try not to die. <laughs> so we'll, be, we'll be fine. Surely you wish to save us. Okay, so run around the house? Which one? Which house? 
if it gets if shit hits the fan, I guess he's done. Okay. I'm gonna try and res him. You guys drink. This day is long overdue. Uh, okay. What the hell? Uh, let's see. Friend is over. I'm I'm pulling him here, but nice, easy. Nice. That is some good loot. 24 strength, 15 hit, the resilience axe. We were just looking at that before the uh, before the run. You guys want to do black morass while we're here? Oh, you got I'm raid. down, but I got a raid in three. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, GG's. Good job, guys. Okay, here's something I want to show you guys. So those of you guys who don't know, like a big Ashbringer guy, right? I have a corrupted Ashbringer in game. I have a real Ashbringer in real life that Nerp sent me in my PO box. Use it. Let's take a mic. Command. I want to show you guys. We're gonna to go to uh, we're gonna to go to South Shore. Is South Shore this side. So here we are in South Shore. This is South Shore years ago, right? Look at this. Renault Mograin, little Jimmy Vicious, and Sally Whitemane are here. So you thought you could break into this palace of the light and run away our secrets, Vicious? Interrogate this criminal at once. My pleasure, my lady. Tell me everything, scum. Tell me I'll, or I'll rip the secrets from your flesh. Look at him, dude. Look at him, he's such a shitter, look at him. So yeah, this is uh, this is the Scarlet Monastery when they were kids. How funny is that? This infidel should be purified. It's funny because they're like five years old <laughs> speaking like this. Mograin has fallen, you should pay for this treachery. At your side, my lady. How funny is this, dude? Dude, role play. So there's a, there's a bunch of stuff here that you can, uh, that you can see. Look, you know what else they did that's funny here? Look at these Hillsbrad citizens. In in old South Shore, or sorry, old Hillsbrad, they used old game models. These are like the original WoW Alpha game models. Cause uh yeah, this is uh this one, this is this one. Look at how like low res they are and shitty. Like I like they they look very um like they look good. Like design wise, they look really good. They're very like Warcraft 3, yeah, exactly. Design wise, it looks good, but it's just like kind of like low res and. <laughs> like, what are those, dude? You're wearing Santa Claus shoes. <laughs> you there. Yes, you, peasant boy. Come quickly. I must tell you something. Oh, yeah. Gaze upon my rippling musculature. Bask in the glow of my physique. I don't know who this guy is. Oh, wait. This guy sells cloaks. This guy is a uh, Taylor. Taylor, uh, the cloak quest. In, uh, in South Shore at level 30 something, right? The Yeti cloak, that's what it is. Hands off the cloak. Yes, yes, I know that you want one too. Everybody wants one of my cloaks. Believe me, person of low morale and social standing, one day I will make my fortune from the sale of my cloaks. Let me, hold on, let me, go get, let me see if my Ashbringer's downstairs. Let me find it. This is my Ashbringer, it was in my P.O. box. Let's see, what else is here? Oh, look, here he is. Look, here's Keldazad, chat. Keldazad is part of the Kirin Tor and Helkular. Kill him now? <laughs> no, you can't kill him now, chat. Dude, I'm telling you, I, I was a big Ashbringer nerd back in the day, and there were so many rumors about different things with like, oh, Keldazad is here, and Naxxramas, Ashbringer, all this, all kinds of crazy stuff. It's cool because it's this is a dungeon. It's it's both a dungeon and a zone. There's no reason to ever like come here. Like the game never tells you to check this out. So this is all put in the game, kind of like as an Easter egg. Look, Hal McAllister and Nat Pagel, the legendary fisherman Nat Pagel is right here, dude. But like this is all this is all however many years in the past. I can't remember the exact amount, but it's so many years in the past. And so like you play through all of vanilla coming to South Shore and doing all this stuff. Captain Sanders and Captain Edward Haynes. It be all right, Ed. Me booty be locked away good in that chest. No fool will ever have Captain Sanders' treasure. Wait, there's booty in the chest? Yeah, there's one more. There's, uh, the beggar, Asmongold. So he's right here. Normally he stays in Stormwind. Uh, asking for gold, but instead he's uh, back in the day. He used to ask for gold in uh, South Shore. This was before he streamed. And he's got the same shirt on too. How crazy is that? Wait, locked chest. Wait, hold on. I didn't know about this. This is Ashbringer's here, chat. It's inside of this. 
Oh, we don't have a rogue. We, oh, it's okay. We don't have a rogue chat. I've never tried to lockpick it. I mean, it'd be cool to see what's inside. More Hillsbrad citizens, my lady. Look, Nathanos Maris, the blight caller. Bilger the straight laced and Raleigh the true. <laughs> it's crazy how every story seemed to start in South Shore. But isn't that cool? Let's see, where's Herod the bully? Oh, oh there he is, Herod the bully, dude. Herod the bully. I like the cowlick they give him, look at that. Oh, oh our rogue is here, okay. I'm Max and it's still red? Wait, what? Wait, so nobody can open this chest. I don't think you can open this. I think they did that on purpose. This is something Blizzard, old Blizzard would do is put something in the game that was just literally impossible to open and then let players try and see if they can figure it out. Okay, here it is. Here's something I want to show you. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on, I don't want to, I don't want to leak. I don't want to leak the story because I think a lot of people haven't seen this. Wait, the in-game music here is from Warcraft 2? Is it really? Okay, well, hold on. We have to reset it and come back then. Chat, it's movie time. The story of the Ashbringer. Commander Morgrain, Tyrion Fordring, Abendance. Keep your voices down. There are strangers about. Brothers and sisters, I have called you here today to discuss the fate of Lordaeron. I hear things, things that should not be. The dead rise, undead from the frozen Northlands. Whole cities have gone missing and I, I have heard that Northrend is lost. We must stand at the ready. I have faced undead before. They are ruthless killing machines, devoid of any emotion or compassion. I, I've battled them as well. We are ill-prepared as a kingdom to withstand such an assault. What do you propose, Morgrain? Propose? I propose that we prepare. That we prepare our loved ones, family and friends for the possibility of an undead holocaust. And there is this. Oh, frick, what the hell, what is that? <gasps> By the light, what is it? I have had this object in my possession for 10 years, since Black Rock Spire. I wrested it free from the remains of an orc lieutenant, a dark caster. It is from their home world. Do not get too close, I laid ha hand upon it once and only once, never again. The memories of that day still linger. I surmise that this object is a living embodiment of shadows, darkness. It is manifestation, it is a void. Uh, I do not see how this evil artifact is relevant to the undead. We must destroy it. No, old friend, it is very relevant. Let me ask you this, brothers and sisters. Can good exist without evil? Can there be light without dark? And if that answer is no, then could it be possible that because this artifact exists, it is polar opposite of... <clears throat> could you imagine what the material manifestation of the light could do against the undead? Nonsense, Morgraine. It must be destroyed. It consumed the light. Impossible. Is, is it getting lighter? It's coloration. It is changing. By the light, could it be? Could this be it? I must know. I will know. <laughs> it, it's beautiful. What I felt when I touched it. The light coursed through me and I threw it. It healed my spirit. Y your hand, it's healed. Let us never again speak of this day. Our enemies are many. They need not know we hold such artifacts. I have seen it. From this blessed crystal, we will forge a weapon. This weapon will hold inside it a piece of each of us. And when it is used against undead, it shall cast them down, and in its wake, it will only leave ashes. The Ashbringer. The Ashbringer, the Ashbringer, the Ashbringer. And that's it, boys. The origins of the Ashbringer. The origins of the mighty, mighty Ashbringer. Only on SFAN TV can you watch a bunch of guys gather around a rock and blow their holy loads on it. Okay. Unbelievable switch. Wait, yeah, where's Carmen's dwarf? 
Yeah, so like in the lore, basically the Ashbringer is made out of a piece of a, a piece of a Naru, a dark Naru that is like purified by, by these guys right here. And then they use it to forge a weapon. So the, the actual, like the, the silver hand, it's made out of that rock, if I'm right. Yeah, it's a special rock that you put around La Casa to uh, block the 5Gs. Yeah, some people call it Shungite.